We made it a point to make sure that we never forgot those lost and the service that was given. That's the West York Borough Manager tonight at a candlelight vigil to honor those lives lost during the September 11, 2001 terror attacks. Though the borough is more than 150 miles and 22 years removed from the Ground Zero incident on 9-11, the impact still hits home in the community. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Evan Forrester. And I'm Amy Lutz. Fox 43's Logan Perrone shows us tonight's ceremony that shines a light on the heroes lost to the dark. Got my foot. Four-year-old Jackson helped set up tonight's vigil in West York to honor those lost to terrorism on September 11, 2001. It's a day he doesn't remember, and one borough manager, Sean Mock, never forgets. Every time I think about it, it takes my breath away. The annual vigil honors the nearly 3,000 people killed that day, including 343 fallen first responders. We do this service to remember the, the bravery and the absolute depth of response we saw that day. Multiple organizations in West York continue to keep the spirit of the fallen sacrifice alive. Never forget for those who sat in terror on the planes, for those who never saw it coming in the buildings, for the loved ones of the lost and the lost themselves, and for the uncommon valor in face of unspeakable evil. Never forget. Mock says the annual ceremony serves to send a message for the future. It's important for the community to teach the next generation of the community and leaders as to why this, why this is important. They continue to remember, so those like Jackson grow up and never forget. Logan Perrone, Fox 43 News.